there's always a way. There's literally you can, so many things you can figure out how to get it done. My name is Whitney Alvarez. I work for Interstate Mechanical Contractors in Knoxville, Tennessee. When I got into high school, I decided I was done with school <laughs> and I didn't want to go to college. My mom's a teacher, actually. She wasn't too psyched about not going to college. I talked to my dad a little bit about it, told him I didn't want to go to college, and he's like, well, you better figure out another plan. The Write and Decide program, it's a program for high school kids. So one month you work with one company, and the next month you work with another. And it's to get kids to see if this works for them or college is a better route. start taking uh, trade classes in high school and welding was just the one that I picked up the easiest. When I was in high school taking the trade classes, I was basically the only girl in every single one. On a daily basis, I'm the only girl who works in the shop out of, and I work with three other guys. In the shop, we bounce around so much. Like this week I was doing screw pipe, next week I could be welding. One day I'm pipe fitting. It's I'm all over the place. At first it was hard because I'm first off simply just not as strong. I don't didn't know as much just starting out, so not knowing how everything works and all that. But these guys here, they anytime I need help pulling something around or I don't understand how something works, they they all work with me. It's great. They treat me just like they treat anybody else. Not everybody's good at it. Not everybody can do it. It takes a lot of practice and a lot of hours. You really, you can't just pick it up and do it. You gotta really put the time and the effort. And every, everybody I meet teaches me something different, a new trick, a new way to do this and that. I like that, but there's not one way to do it. I think there'll be more women in it down the line. I think people are starting to realize that it's okay for a girl to work in a construction industry. College isn't the only option. You don't have to do, just because somebody tells you this is what you're supposed to do, you can go and work and be a welder or a plumber, construction worker, whatever you want. You don't have to do what everybody's telling you.